well-deserved fame of Guadalajara's main plaza, or Socolo, rests in the great merit of her architectural monuments, which clearly interpret the achieving spirit that has made her the proud second city of the Republic, boasting a population of 200,000 souls. Outlined against the background of the plaza, we see the stately towers of the cathedral, a magnificent structure which has contributed greatly to the reputation of this city. Founded by Don Juan de Oñate, a trusted lieutenant of the incredible Hernán Cortés in 1530, Guadalajarans were worshipping and enjoying its beauty in hometown comfort nearly a hundred years before the arrival of the Puritans at Plymouth. Fronting one side of the square stands the governor's palace behind a magnificent facade. Through its lofty portals passed untold numbers of judges and other vice-regal officials during centuries of Spanish splendor. Outstanding among the city's wealth of beautiful old edifices is the church and convent of Santa Monica. In its exceptionally fine stone carving, we cannot fail to sense the refinement of an age that achieved immortality through its attention to artistic detail. Such a spirit bequeaths indescribable beauty to posterity. The Museum of Ancient History has been established in this lovely old building, which was itself formerly a convent. Enclosing a spacious courtyard is a particularly noble arcade. Its lines speak eloquently of the aesthetic development of its constructors. Within are to be seen many invaluable relics, religious ornaments and jewels, as well as glorious canvases from the 15th, 16th, and 17th centuries. Works of the masters, Murillo, Cabrera, and Juarez hang here. The requirements of the everyday visitor are not neglected either in this city of fine values. The very latest in hotel facilitation and comfort is courteously provided for the enjoyment alike of the foreign tourists and Mexican compatriots on holiday. Some 25 kilometers outside Guadalajara are the falls of Guanacatlan, which today provide the city and many adjacent communities with an abundance of light and power. The ancient legend that in order to ensure good luck in later life, newlyweds must visit this fall is remindful of our own Niagara honeymoon tradition. The bright foam melts mystically into the soft breezes of Jalisco, creating a moment of rainbow beauty to mark the transition. 